Hi there, my name is Will with Apex Gaming PCs. In today's tutorial, we're going to show you exactly how to configure your Core P3 model by having the GPU horizontal or vertical. To do this, you're going to need two thumb screws included in your accessories kit, one screwdriver, and your GPU covered in bubble wrap. Ours isn't, for obvious reasons. All right, so this is the place where we're going to want to focus on for inserting the GPU into the motherboard. As you can see right here, there are two things that we have to look out for. One, to make sure these screws are open and ready to receive the GPU when we seat it. And two, that this clip on the motherboard is set to an out position, like so. Once that's done, you can start by inserting your GPU, like so. You're going to want to line it up with the holes that don't have screws in them and the PCIe slot with the gold straps and do one snap, like so. Once you do that, you can press in the metal pieces, lightly thread with the thumb screws for one and two, and then come back the screwdriver to make sure they're completely secure. Once that's completed and the motherboard has been securely fastened to the GPU, we can go and take our GPU power wire, the PCIe, and attach it like so. With a click, we should have everything ready to power on our PC. There we go, our PC powers on with no issues. In the next segment of the video, we're gonna go over our vertical configuration and how you can assemble your PC for that. All right, so this is our second configuration for our Core P3. As you can see right here, we have a ribbon cable for a vertical GPU configuration. There are two things that we really have to pay attention to before we seat the GPU. The first thing is that we have these two screw holes open and ready to receive the GPU. And then the second one is that we have this clip set to open, like so. Once we do that, we're ready to seat the GPU. So, taking the GPU, we're going to align it with the holes right here. And make sure that those gold threads enter the PCIe slot, like so. It takes a little bit of finagling to get, but once you have it lined up, you're ready to insert it with one click, as you can hear right there. Then we're going to take our screws, we're going to lightly thread them to begin with. Once we do that, we're going to come back with the screwdriver and secure them. Once we do that, we make sure our GPU is secure. We're going to take our PCIe power connector and we're going to orient it in a way where we can plug it into the GPU, like so. Once you do that, you can secure it with one click. Once you're done with that, you're good to power on your PC. And there we go. PC powers on with no issues. We hope you enjoyed this little tutorial that we put together. If you have any questions or don't know how to proceed at any step, please don't hesitate to contact support at apexgamingpcs.com or call 215-565-1069. Thank you so much.